Just got off work and there's an estate sale sign on the way out, so let's try. Good, how are you? stuff. They had some 
some good stuff. But if I had gotten there and seen those prices after driving 45 minutes, I would have been angry. Very, very angry. As usual, I will have to mute the video because the music in Goodwill is always on the copyright list and it is always blasting. I had to go check out the artwork first. One of my really, my best friend, uh, is looking for two 16 by 20 frames for her dog's portraits that she had done like they are you know old world paintings they are fabulous of course luckily all the purses were pretty much the same i found this little bin with all these cute toys and i should have probably looked in this thing it looked interesting but it just, I didn't feel like dealing with it today. We had lots of little toys and stuffed animals in the bins today. I don't even, quite honestly, I'm, I'm recording this voiceover a week later and I couldn't tell you what it was in there. So we are looking at it together. Just waiting for the video to degrade again. Uh, I recorded the haul on my old phone. Well, it's a couple phones back for me, but hopefully that will keep the video from messing up. I'm going to have to contact my phone company or, or the uh, actual I'll have to contact Samsung to see if they can uh, fix it this is a bag of chandelier drops I have a box already and I definitely could not leave these behind I did just see a whole bunch of Pinterest ideas for turning them into Christmas ornaments which were pretty cool I might try some of that if I don't just sell them outright. The Jesus puzzle looked very interesting. And if I had known all the pieces were there, I would have grabbed him. Definitely one of the most famous versions of Jesus. A uh, bin full of books th uh, that had really nothing interesting. Eventually I will get better at this because quite honestly when the bins are interesting I usually put my phone down because I'm too busy digging. Uh, this is the Happy Meal Girl, and she's super cute. I had to get her. My husband is a huge McDonald's guy. Apparently her top, there's a little length of hair on top that's super long, and uh, it needs to be braided, and I will do that and get her kind of cleaned up. My granddaughter has, of course, cleaned her because she's a baby. There's some fries. I'm not sure if they make her or not. But it was worth a shot. I usually try to save all the little handwork, but I put this one back today. It just didn't speak to me. I'm trying to get this thrift with me video out because my haul video is already done and I'm just behind quite the videos messing up has just really taken away much of the 
joy and I had in making the videos. So I'm falling behind. But next Friday, the oh, what is it? The 16th is the 100th anniversary of Goodwill in Memphis. I don't know if it's just for Memphis or Goodwill everywhere, but they are doing a little giveaway thing. If you show up, the first 100 customers get a scratch off card and you can possibly win up to $100. And sounds like a fun time to me. You don't have to twist my arm to go to Goodwill. But that does sweeten me in deal for making the drive up in the Memphis. It will probably be packed because it is the one up on Stage Road by Wolf Chase. So if you are in the Memphis area, you might see me there. I know we're all shocked that the video messed up again. This blanket was so big and it was really pretty, but it was, had so many problems with it. It was just falling apart. I would have put it on my bed had it not been just absolutely falling to pieces. Got a Tabasco mug and just some random mugs. Sometimes our little bins are just full of nothing. But you still got to look through them because you never know when you're going to find a gem. It was not going to be this time. Hi, how y'all doing? How are you? Good. Wear one every day. One Trump shirt. Any Christmas trees? Somehow I managed to not record any of the other garage sales I went to, but I did go to a couple more and I really only got some clothes and stuff at one more. They're in the hall. Quick swing through. <laughs> Okay. This is this is our holding table. Gotcha. I certainly can. Thank you very much. Uh huh. Shania was singing a little too loud to just keep the audio, so. We're back in voiceover. Hopefully the video holds out till the end. 
I happen to remember there was an estate sale in South Haven. I was headed to my friend's crawfish boil and I did a quick swing through. I was looking around. I didn't know for sure if it was 50% off day. I knew it was the last day, but I didn't think that would guarantee a 50% off day. But I did find out later, yes, 50% off. I just was grabbing things that I thought were adorable, like these little angels over here, I think is what I'm about to grab. I really kind of wish I had gotten that silverware. I did get these little sweeties. And I'm almost out of video. I only recorded a little bit more, but I got a whole lot of stuff and that will be in the haul. And so y'all need to check back for the haul. Thanks so much for joining me on this thrift with me. See you later. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Thank you for watching. I would love to hear what your favorite find was.